this would be the perfect week to kind of film like a week in my life as I go to school because I realized I've not actually filmed how my school routine looks like um, it is currently 8 30 something and I'm actually about to leave my house to go um, I don't usually leave the house this early but I do need to be on campus early for like a meeting with my professor and I never eat breakfast in the morning because it makes me feel kind of sick but since I'm leaving way early at like 8 instead of usual 10 a.m. I just have like a slice of bread with like some prosciutto pros whatever that word is so i'm gonna eat this really quickly and um i figured this would be the perfect week to like vlog a week in my life at school just because next week is thanksgiving break and then the week after that is basically the final week of school and nothing much happens so um as you saw i woke up packed my bag having a quick lunch i should get my water so my friends always laugh at me for always wearing a bunch of layers because I get cold so easily. And as you can see, I just have one jacket on. So I honestly want to put another jacket on. So because all my friends laugh at me, I'm not going to. Um, I will show them I'm not weak. I know, I'm going to regret this when I leave the house. Mm. You probably can't even hear me with food in my mouth. That is so rude. I'm so sorry. Mm. Okay, Google. What's the time? It's 8.37 a.m. Okay, let's go to school. <laughs> It is 126 right now so i think i'm gonna just be in bed to like maybe like 140 just kind of like do nothing i've got my blanket and my electric blanket over here and i'm gonna eat some lunch because i'm starving but i'm just kind of lazy right now and then i'm gonna finish reading the book i think i have about a few pages to go i'm like on page 100 and something i've got like another 100 to go i uh, don't worry the book will be done before 6 p.m and um i will probably leave here at five to catch the bus and then i probably won't vlog as much after class because i'm going to be so tired when i get back home it's going to sleep so that's that's this is the day in the life of a grad student um you just you're just tired i finished the book this is such a bad angle but i'm so tired 220 something pages i started this book last night it's actually really good so i need to send in some like revision questions for this um yeah so i got my lazy ass out of bed and um i just put pasta on the stove and now i have to decide what to go wearing because i only wore real clothes today because um i was teaching and i had my meeting in the morning but usually when i come back home when i go back i honestly just go wearing sweats because i hate wearing clothes i hate wearing clothes so much i feel like it just restricts my skin so i kind of just want to go wearing some sweats let me see what's in my closet i 
I need to rearrange my closet as well because now that it's winter time, I want to get all of my winter clothing on the hangers and all my summer clothes on the shelf. Oh, okay. I'm going to go wearing my black and white sweats. So I'll probably just keep the same sweater and um, under neck thing that I'm wearing underneath to be warm. I'm wearing like these Uniqlo heat tech pants right now. So I might just wear sweats and I think I'm just going to wear my Crocs um because i'm gonna come back with the car i mean i'm taking the bus to go to class but i'm gonna come back because um one of my friends is gonna drop me off so i might just go in and crocs but then that means i have to wear longer socks also do you guys sleep wearing socks because i've actually been getting bullied for sleeping wearing socks why don't you sleep wearing socks like i feel like anybody who's got a brain will sleep wearing socks so you can feel warm but anyway that's not my business. So I got back home. It's 9.46. And I'm so glad I made that pasta. Because that's what I'm about to eat for dinner. You know, juice. As you guys know, I cannot eat without drinking. So I'm going to drink some juice. So this is how my Mondays usually go. Um, I come back super tired and all of that. Um, so tomorrow is Tuesday and I'll be going to class again. Um, I have a lot of work I need to do. Man, I kind of do like a boy in this angle. It's fine. So I'm just gonna eat, drink, um, call it quits. And I'll see you all tomorrow. So, yay, I'm done for the day. Um, I think it's like noon. Okay, that's not behind me. Um, my mouth feels so dry, but I'm getting home right now. I just got off the bus, so now I'm walking to my house. This, my Tuesday is kind of just ends here. So, I am listening to um, Take Care right now because I actually just found out today is like the 10 year anniversary of the album. And I remember I was listening to this a lot back when I was like 14, 15. And I'm just here like, wow. When I first listened to this album, I literally had could not comprehend what Drake was talking about. Like, I mean, I was a 14 year old kid. Why do I know about heartbreaking shit, you know? And now listening to this album again, after you've been through that shit, you're just like, damn, you really were going through it. You know, so I have like Take Care playing right now. Oh, it's such a bop, oh my God. Oh yeah, I'm gonna go home. I'm feeling really lazy. I really don't want to do anything, but I know I'm actually behind in uh, a lot of my classwork. I'm like three weeks behind in one class because I just haven't been doing the work, so I should probably catch up on that. But I just think I might go home, lie in bed for a little bit, just kind of like, you know, get back into the groove of doing something, and then I'm going to get out of bed, clean my room, do my dishes, um, eat something. And then start doing work. I don't know. But yeah, really uneventful. I honestly spend most of my days just doing nothing. Like, I could be doing work. I really could. But I just don't. So, let me go home now. And yeah. Also, I am pretty sure my period is starting today. And this is just not the right mind space you want to be in. Let's into the stupid ass album because we're not trying to be channeling in those fields, okay? We're not trying to be thinking about the days that niggas did us dirty. Oh my god, this is so embarrassing. Wow. So I need to go home and get out of these fields. You know, you know this body is honestly a fucking betrayer. Like, why are you making everything so emotional when it's really not that deep? Take care by Drake and Rihanna. 
Sorry, something went wrong. What is wrong with ready? you? Give it another try. Yeah, body's too I really hate being on my period. It just makes me feel like my mood fluctuates so much. Um, I was like in a slump for like a good 10 minutes, but I kind of did something. Wait, I think the lighting's better here. I kind of did some. Also, he's my friend. I'm gonna tell him he's so cute. You know, some people say he's ugly, but I just think they're jealous because they're ugly. You know, like how can you call this ugly? He's just so adorable and so cute but um i cleaned my room i'll show you in a little bit and i kind of like attempted to dress up by putting a jacket on top of my my sweater honestly this um this turtleneck was not worth the money that i spent on it because i got this like a really nice store but it's just piles so much i mean you can't really see it in the camera but it just piles i'm just showing you my boob now Oops. it just piles so much and i feel like for the price that i paid you should not be piling this much which is just really annoying so i just threw on like a really nice um fluffy sweater i got some converse on because i'm going to the post office now so i'm just gonna like leave my house for a little bit and i honestly kind of want to go to a bookstore to kind of like i know get some peace in my life but I know if I go to the bookstore one, I'll definitely spend money and I don't want to do that because I'm going to New York next week so I should save my money. And then two, it's getting dark pretty quickly. Like It's like 2 p.m. right now but it just looks so gray and ugly. And I don't want to walk all the way to the bookstore just to come back when it's dark. And I also have a lot of work I need to catch up on. So, you know, also my skin is so dry and I'm breaking up because, you know, Auntie Flo is coming. Like, look at this bag. This is embarrassing. So I think I need to do like some skincare tonight, like a face mask or something like that. Here, let me just put you here. Do like a face mask or something like that. And then just kind of like, I don't know, try and get like my shit together or something. This is like a, this, this jacket is actually like a XXL, I think. It's really big, but I just feel like it looks really cute. Uh, one of my pet peeves with jackets is I hate jackets that have like fur or like shearing outside. Then they have this material inside. Like, what is this going to do? This is not gonna keep me warm. Like, I want all of this in here. And that's why I love the Uniqlo jacket so much because they have like the fur outside and inside. This is just not warm, like, no. So you're probably thinking, why did I buy the jacket? Because I never buy jackets like this. It was on sale, so I bought it. Anyway, um, I'm gonna go to the post right now then i'll see you guys there okay so it's basically three the post office is really walking distance from me so i guess if i maybe i should go to the bookstore like listen to some music go for like a nice walk maybe when i come back into my house i won't feel as like claustrophobic phobic claustrophobic yeah i won't feel as like trapped as i was feeling like an hour ago maybe we'll do that okay google what time is the sun setting okay she said screw you okay we are gonna go to the bookstore because i just love bookstores like i love secondhand bookstores like they're just like so old and the books have been read before and you can just think of like the person's story in the bookstore so let's go to the bookstore before they close okay i will take a backpack okay let's go to the bookstore Oh, also, I said I'll show you guys that I cleaned my room. I just did my bed really poorly. I just threw some shit together. I need to put those jackets back in the closet because I'm wearing this one right now. And um, I have shoes all over my house. So these are my unique little fluffies that I wear in my room only because, you know, my room is clean. So I'm always just chilling here when I'm reading. Then I've got like my indoor shoes, which are really furry. These are my outdoor shoes with have like fur in them. Like it's tease the season. Get the fur out. And yeah, that's just a box of like my pads, cause you know, I need that. So yes. Also, yeah, I really love color coding shit. Like I love the theme of the blues and the silvers. And let me just, I need this for my walk. So I'll get this pig. So I just love how this little blue things going on. This is my new face cream that I really like. 
um this is i also like this too it's like an overnight mask which i might do tonight so this is also color coded i've got my greens color coded here as well like with my books and stuff there's a book that's always here that's missing that you guys saw previously that i packed in so i really do keep like some greens here random colors in there i've got like my blue books here my red books here all my black stuff is in there and like you no, know, my books are here color coded in blue yellow reds i just love the aesthetic of color i just like how it looks okay let me stop wasting time and go um i think i'm gonna take my pen again I'm gonna pack it with water and my wallet and this is what i need to return so it's a dress and some books Yes, I know my face looks really, really glowy, but I just took a shower. Um, I just took a shower and I'm full so refreshed and so clean. And I put on a slipping mask on my face. Um, not that anybody asked. Oh yeah, I keep my mask up here, you know. I have this like Neutrogena moisturizer. And then I put this Laneige, Laneige, I don't know. I put this sleeping mask on. I used to think that sleeping mask was the stupidest things ever because you put it on your face and when you lie down on your pillow it's really gone but I always wake up with my skin feeling very hydrated because I have really dry skin and it gets so dry in the winter like I'm not even going to show you my legs like they are literally white as fuck because one I didn't put on lotion because I'm lazy and two my skin just gets so dry if I don't put moisturizer really quickly so I would just take care of my face only um so i'm just gonna get into bed start doing my work i'm not gonna vlog myself in bed because i don't want to get out of bed go back in look at the clips and all that stuff so this is where i'm going to um call it quits and i'll see you guys tomorrow good night um if i told you i've just been oh we don't want to expose the goods on this channel here if I told you that I've just been goofing around <laughs> for the past, I don't know how many hours, would you believe me? Yes, yes you would, because I would believe me too. Um, yeah, it's time to get to work, and I have not done any work, honestly. I mean, it's not like I have a lot of work to do. I'm kind of just thinking I'm just going to bed and waking up early, because... Um, Tomorrow is Wednesday, so I teach from 11 to noon. Then I have class from 1 to 4, and I'm done for the day. And, um, oh, that's loud. And for the class I'm teaching tomorrow, I already have it lesson plan. They're just gonna be working in class, it's not really a big deal. I just have to like read some stories for my own class tomorrow, plus like write responses to them. Ah, <sighs> goddamn. I think I'm going to choose myself and um i'm gonna go sleep and then i'll wake up at like five or six or seven or something and um get some writing done or i will read the stories when i'm in bed and then do the responses in the morning i feel that's a better idea yeah that's what i'll do yeah okay good night i don't even know if i'm frame whatever but it is 8.44, I woke up at 7, and then I went back to sleep, woke up again, went back to sleep, woke up again, went back to sleep, then I woke up at 8, and my stomach was so painful, 
so I know my period's supposed to start. Like, I feel like if I go pee, I can probably make it start, which I should do. Because I'd rather I start it now before I leave my house so I'm prepared. And I don't want to ambush me when I go to school. But, um, but gotta make sure I'm not exposing my flat chest. Um, my face is so swollen because I, I just woke up, but... I'm trying to do some lesson planning. I did not do any work last night. I just spent like an hour and a half literally just reminiscing. Got a little homesick, but you know, it is what it is. And um, it's time to get some work done before I go to school. Okay, so I'm in my office now, and actually these walls are really, really thin, so I don't want to talk too much because, well, there's nobody next door, so it doesn't matter, but, um, I, mean, I have no idea what just happened, but I'm in my office, which is in the library, I'm on the 12th floor, and then, like, you know, the people who are in here, usually it's just me in here, or this person here, um, so I'm gonna do my work. Like, I feel like I haven't been updating you guys. Like, yesterday I found out I got approved to teach creative writing. And because I teach, like, English essays and stuff like that, which I don't really like. But teaching fiction is, like, what I want to do at school. Not, like, a profession or anything like that. So I just got approved to teach creative writing for next spring, I think. So I have to kind of, like, accept that offer. And then I also got into a workshop by Tin House, you know, again. And I think I mentioned this, like, in the summer that I got into Tin House for the first time. It was really exciting. And then this time I got in again. Um, so, you know, doing good things, hearing some good news. Um, so I'm just going to work on some applications and um, do the work I didn't do last night because I was doing an hour. Let's do this work. Let's get this brush. Hey, where are my AirPods? Actually, uh, don't you just hate it when you get in bed, you forget something, then you have to go back and get it? But yeah, it is now midnight, I think, if not 1 a.m. Yeah, oh shit, it's actually 1.32, whoa, oops. It's 1.32 a.m., I just took a shower. I'm about to finish up um some work on my computer, and then I'm just gonna sleep because I'm so tired. Um, Tomorrow's Thursday, oh. Um, Tomorrow's Thursday, and that's like my day off. I'm just too tired to even talk. So I got back. I got Chipotle. Watched back with my roommates. Um, chatted to my friends a little bit. Um, took a shower. Did the last minute work. And I'm just going to pass out. And then I'm going to wake up tomorrow at 9, 9.30. Because I'm going to the mall to go pick up my heater for my table. And just like do a bit of window shopping. Since I'm going to New York next week. And yeah. I'm just gonna go I'm just gonna do this real quick because I'm so exhausted. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you.
um hello look like i just woke up oh my god i need to stop like my mom hasn't been watching my videos lately which is fine and you know i know she hasn't been watching because she hasn't in, um what's happened to me and been like ten why are you on the internet looking like you just woke up yeah she will not be pleased to see this when she does see this but um yeah it's sunday and i'm pretty sure the last time you saw me was like wednesday or thursday tuesday maybe yeah but honestly that's exactly how my life looks like as a student i try one day i give up the others you know it really is big i'm really just coasting and surviving through this program but i'm just like so burnt out and like I just, I just need a break from school but um yeah i mainly stopped vlogging because my period started on thursday i think and yeah i was going through it you know like cramps trying to kill me hormones were out of whack adele's new album had dropped it was just a whole combo of everything so i just said nah i'm not gonna vlog 